In this video, you'll learn how to add items to the searchable Diagnosis Codes catalog. When working in a patient's medical record, in Medical Record Quick Links, you have the option to add in a diagnosis entry. When adding in a diagnosis entry, in your name field is where you can enter in the diagnosis information, like Achilles tendon root tear. However, within event practice, you also have the ability to do a search against a catalog of diagnoses in the select diagnosis code box. Just by starting to type in a portion of the name, or you can do searching by code and choose the appropriate one that you're needing. This catalog of diagnosis codes that you're searching against is customizable and you can add your own items to be searchable on. In order to use the diagnosis catalog, it first needs to be enabled on your site. If you do not have this option available, first go to your gear icon and on your general tab, scroll down to the medical record settings section and you will want to ensure that the enable diagnosis codes setting is checked off. This is the catalog that you can maintain to do the searching against. Also, if you do not see the option under medical record quick links for diagnosis, ensure under the medical record quick link settings drop down that the diagnosis option is also checked. If you needed to check off either of these settings, ensure you go down to the bottom of the page and hit your save button. When you have the Diagnosis Codes Catalog feature enabled, under your Configuration menu options, you will see the Diagnosis Code selection. This is where you go to manage that catalog. To add in additional items to be searchable against, click Add Custom Diagnosis Code. Enter in a code and the name or the description of the diagnosis and hit your Save button. For items that you have added in to the diagnosis catalog, you will see an edit pencil if you needed to go in and make any adjustments to it. For the system added ones that were pre-populated with your site, you do not have an edit pencil. However, you can delete them to remove them from the catalog if they're not something that you need to have available. As well as the ones that you added in yourself, you can delete those as needed.